Previously on another dumb show. But that was a damn good natural segue, if I ever heard. Ah, shit. The two best moments of my life. (laughs) They, the two best moments of my life, other than the third, might be standing in the room with us. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, if you guys could get a big round of applause, that means the two of you. How about my boys? Give it up. Brady and Shay are in the house. Let's hear it for Look at these guys running. <laughs> Look at like it's WWE out here. <laughs> I should have. Do you guys want an intro song? Should I have played an intro oh, song man, for you guys? Oh, man, They could have tried it on. Be- you want to try that again, it, guys? Here again. we go. <laughs> All right. There they are. <laughs> the hey, official Luke, Brady and Shay intro music. Luke, you here they are. Can you turn that Another hand, Miles please? original. Oh. No, I should have. That would have been fun if I played that. I did not Thanks, expect expecting Brett. these two. These two are usually the most flaccid, <laughs> docile, <laughs> oh, chill dudes you'll ever meet. I did not expect them to come bounding in like that. Brady and Shay. Well, oh, Brady, I don't have you on. Sorry, buddy. Welcome, gentlemen. How are you? <laughs> Shay wanted to do a whole thing coming in. He said he wanted to do a moonwalk you, coming no, in. No, no, no. I didn't oh. say that. <laughs> <Brady's> <laughs> no. lying. Y'all got to talk to me sooner, man. I could have <laughs> prepared the music and everything. <laughs> no, that's great. How are you, gentlemen? We are good. It's good to see you. Uh, these two guys, uh, they've been here. Uh, this is their first time here at the One Life to Play Another Dumb Show Studios. Yep. And what do you think so far, boys? It's nice. It's fun. It's nice. Shay, pull that mic nice and close to your mouth, my friend. Don't be afraid to. Yep, use the black thing. That's your nose, not your, your mouth. Nose. That's your yeah, nose. your nose. <laughs> <laughs> he usually can put stuff in his mouth really easily. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that about your kids ever. <laughs> I was a fat boy, too, so I can say that. He knows. We're all getting chunky in our uh, age, but my dudes, welcome. Uh, so, what did you think? You guys like the uh, studios? Yeah. Hell yeah! What's your favorite part since you got here? Is my uh, mic on? Yeah. Okay, I was just making sure. Yeah, oh, he doesn't. Watching. He doesn't have hit. Oh, you have. You have the headphones. You should hear yourself. I ain't got. I headphones. can't hear myself. Oh. 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 It's well, on. Uh, take that off a little bit then, bud, so you can hear both of us. You really don't need them on other than maybe for a phone call if we take one. So you guys can take – if those aren't uh, putting any sound through, you don't need to use them. I'm just but waiting for – I'm waiting for Keely to call in and say You're hi, waiting for – Keely's working, so Keely won't be calling in. So I expect, uh, I expect a personal her to break. call in. So. <laughs> He's going to take a personal break just to call in again. <laughs> I love this. Somebody just said uh, – Jake just said, Dumb says these kids are nerds and hate sports. Dude is wearing an LBJ shirt today, and the other one's wearing <laughs> – The baseball, other one's wearing right? a baseball shirt. The other uh, probably would have – was on sale at the thrift store when their mom took them. So that's, <laughs> that's probably why they have those shirts on. No. Yeah, well, I'm it just isn't kidding. our fault. I don't want to go to thrift stores. I mean, that's all we do every – I know your mom loves the thrift stores. So uh, what is your uh, so Brady, tell everybody how old you are. I am 13, 13. Shay, how old are you? 10. All right. I had them say it because I always forget. All the oh. <laughs> I always mess it up and get it he wrong. Always, you I, always forget our age. I'm Mexi- I'm 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 I remember their birthdays. I just don't remember how old they're turning on those days. See, my I'm, son, my son, I remember the age. I forget his birth date. Oh, see, that's interesting. I'm the other way around. And my dad was. I was the same way. He'd always, be, how old are you? And I'd be like, what the fuck? You fuck? I'm you sorry. What? You made me. <laughs> so, <laughs> how do you not know how old I am? But no, I get it. It's hard to keep track of a lot of numbers when you're a dad. Uh, all these yeah, grades, I don't keep track like, of all my mistakes well, they, either. The number changes every year. <laughs> the grade changes every year. It's a lot to keep up with, you know? It's only hey, two hey, kids. I have straight only eggs. two kids, hey, dads. I, I have straight eggs. Dad. Three, Dad. three, honey. I, there's, oh, you have yeah. an older sister, remember? Keely. Yes. <laughs> that's, who he wants, wow. that's who he wants to call, but he can't remember her right now. So uh, the, these two guys, they just went on a trip, and one of the reasons I brought them in, I know you guys think it's lame. Oh, some people, hey, this guy's fucking kids on the show or whatever. They hear me swear all the time, by the way. So It's nothing they're, new. Yeah, they're yeah, used they're to really it. I, literally nothing new. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> that, was the, My, that was the most genuine, true know, reaction right? to anything I've ever heard. God, kids are great sometimes. I'm so glad I got that right on camera, too. All right? was, we all care. We all care. <laughs> I'm going to clip that. That's funny, boys. Um, So they actually, the two of them were just on a trip. They went to Philadelphia. And when anybody goes to Philadelphia, you got to do two things. One, to me, you you run the Rocky Steps, right? You got to do that. You got to run the the steps in front of the art museum. And I think the Rocky statue's there now. I'm not sure. And then number two, you go to that corner that has Geno's and Pat's on it. The cheesesteak thing. So yes. you do the you you see who because they they've been in a battle for years. I don't actually even know. I don't know enough about Philly to know who came first. 
But I know there's a legendary battle going on between Pats and Geno's as to who has the best cheesesteak in Philadelphia. I see I see some already jumping into the chat too. The funny thing is is we talked about that movie um earlier this week, Hustle. Did you see Pat <laughs> did you see Pats in the in move in the movie? What say that I get distracted because uh, RMGJLR said, way to humble brag, Dom, remembering your kids' birthdays. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Uh, yeah. So, no, did, did you notice um, the, the clip to Pat in uh, the movie Hustle? Uh, I did, actually. Yeah. Yes. And I actually, so was Pat's first? Do we know? Yeah, Pat's, was, I think Pat's was first, then Geno's came around. And this is actually seeing that movie Hustle. Okay. And then I never been to Philly, but I know about the, the rivalry. I know about right. all that. Neither I have you. I. I've so, just seen it on TV and like Food Network right. and stuff. So I saw it on in that movie Hustle, and I was watching with my wife, and she said, like, how far is Philly? We should go to Philly. I was like, I would love to go to Philly just for, for that shit right that, there, that, right, that cheesesteak. Yeah. And I'm not a sandwich guy. I'm not. I'm not really a sandwich guy. We'll get into that later. But I'm not a sandwich guy. Me neither, but I really. want to try this cheesesteak. Okay. Well, I've actually. I take that back. I've turned into more. I used to be off the sandwich train, but now I'm back on the sandwiches, especially cheesesteaks. Cheesesteaks are my shit. I love them. So, gentlemen. Yes. When you went there, you you went there. You did all the tour stuff. You checked out the Liberty Bell, right? Oh yeah. 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 Still broken. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I got him with that dad joke too. <laughs> this is a good dad joke, I think. Uh, having said that, boys. Uh, you there were no plans on the books for them to go to Pat's or Geno's. Yeah, I I literally pounded this two of them on their text messages to the point where I strategically waited until they were on the phone, like on a, a, a we like Google Duo. We'll do like the video calls with each other, right? Because I'm I'm an Android guy, not a FaceTime guy. Except for Brady, Brady's, more power to you. Brady's more power all, to you. Brady's all bougie. He's he's too cool for uh for he's a he's an Apple dude. He's too cool for Android. That's so. what you wish. Oh, you wish I was <laughs> as cool as you. Is that what no, you're saying? No, that's uh, what you wish. You wish I was as cool as you. Hey, I saw someone in the chat spelled my name wrong. It's S H A E. Oh, thanks for the heads up, shit. Damn. Sure I'm <laughs> He is my son. I'm the same way. I'm, I get very. Uh, I don't like. I'm. Uh, you spell my name with a W. I'm going to correct you. It's, there's a U. That's a U. Uh, so anyway, I, I got him on the Google Duo, and I said I was waiting till they were their mom was around in the background to where I could p- just really go. You got to go to Pat. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Got to go to Pat or Gino. <laughs> nice to see which one's best. And so eventually, I ta- I actually finally just texted her and said, "You can, can you text just, him? Just take, take him, him right?" So they did end up going to uh, yes. Pat. You, so wait, yeah, you, it was really good. So hold on, oh, yeah, hold, on. Say, hold on. I want to reconfirm. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. So you went. I didn't go to you yet. You went to you went to, <laughs> to you went to the corner. Did you see they're right across the street from yeah, each other? Yeah, yeah. And right now, and each other. like right across the street. It's and funny. now, and they were both open at the same time, right? Yes, both open at the same time. And now. You have to remember too. Uh, my ex-wife, uh, she married a guy who has like twenty-seven kids too. <laughs> so it's like the Brady bunch over there. Not just because my son Brady's there, because there's a like the old TV show where there's a remarried couple with like six kids in the house, right? It's At terrible. times, yeah. It's no oh, stop. You love Sometimes. it. Whoa. You know you Whoa. love it. Whoa. Whoa. We'll get to why it's this there. is well, our typical guys. kid stuff. So yeah, your mom's gonna know that. So <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna tell Brady you said that your your sister. But anyway, having said that. They're on this trip. They got all these people. So they've got a team, right? They could have one half of the group go to Pat's and one mm-hmm. half of the group go to Gino's. Mm-hmm. They only go to one restaurant. Mom didn't yeah. want to spend a lot yeah. of money. That's it was, I understand. But everybody so... has to eat, right? Yeah. yeah. And I, 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 I mentioned So you them. get the same one sub from, for everyone. So you got, say you have, what, there's six of you guys? We, we, we all Just us. answer my question. Let me handle. Were there six of you? Yes. Okay. So. so wouldn't it have made sense? Three from Pat's, three from Geno's. And then you cut those in half and everybody gets half a sub and you've not spent that much money. That's exactly what we said. Like, and mom was, we, it's because Gino smells worse than Pat's. <laughs> 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 Reason. Wow. I think he forgot forgot this is on video and his yeah. mom gonna see her. Oh, okay, wait, wait, wait. I mean, but that's a, that's an <laughs> honest. Oh, you should have cut to him right there. The look on his face. Oh, you didn't realize you didn't there. hear you didn't hear me saying that already. This is archived. But no, right yeah. when I said that, the look he just went. 
Oh, oh crap. Oh, crap. Mom's going to nail me. But no, <laughs> be, be, be respectful mom, of your mother, gentlemen. Mom won't watch us. Oh, okay. okay. Well, yeah. regardless, you should still be re re uh, respectful of your mother. You in, Behind closed doors, the two of you, whatever the hell you do, I can't control that. But <laughs> yeah. when you're on a camera, be respectful of your mother. Having said that, so you guys only got Pats then. Which one has the cheese whiz? Oh, the Pats. Pats. Pats has the cheese whiz. Yeah. And, this, and so it was because Gino stinks is what you're saying. You know why? You know why Gino stinks? Smell. Because they used real cheese. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Cheese Whiz is, uh, not, well, I don't know. Is it part real cheese? I don't know. I think I don't they really said cheese Whiz is not real cheese. Normally, I'm not a Cheese Whiz guy. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, that is, yeah. Um, yeah, normally I'm not a Cheese Whiz guy. Uh, I like a uh, real cheese. But I, I think on this situation, that's the home of cheesesteaks, right? So you have to do it. If that's yeah, Pat's is first yeah. and they put the Whiz on it, you got to try the Whiz. I'm not saying don't try it. Don't make it good. I'm just giving the reasoning why there's a difference in that in that, in that, in that smell. But I wouldn't put it down to the smell, man. Don't don't go to a place because it's... Did it See? smell like... Turd Ferguson says yeah. the Whiz, whiz it slaps. It smelled so. fun. It actually... It, it, it did. Fun. I think Mom was just exaggerating a bit. Possibly. Okay, no so Ty said you're blaming this all on your mom, Buckaroo. I'm not I'm trying to set him up for that either. <laughs> well, I, didn't, I no. mean, that's kind of what she did say, though. I, I did. Okay, so Ty says he prefers Geno's. So I tell you what, it's very, uh, I don't know, I guess it's split in the chat, but I, I've not been there. I thought they both use ribeye. I see Ty saying that the ribeye tastes different, too. Oh, I, I, Okay, they do both use ribeye because you can't make the Philly, you can't make the Philly cheesesteak well, without ribeye, right? So I guess, well, I don't know. I, I, yeah, you have to have ribeye. Sliced okay. ribeye, that's, okay. yeah, that's the thing. I saw... I didn't know somebody was making a sirloin Philly cheesesteak or something out here. <laughs> well, people do the, like the cheap ones. Sure, you can get away with doing that probably on like a, I'm sure most of like you little Stinky restaurants where you're getting a cheesesteak around here. You're not getting like nice. <laughs> no, here, nobody's yeah, cutting here. a strip steak and you know <laughs> shaving it down or whatever. You're getting you know whatever. Um, so you guys didn't get to try both. But what's your review of Pat's? Versus you've had cheese like I've made you cheesesteaks. We've gotten them here. What do you think of Pat's? What's your review? It, it was, was really, really good. Really I, I really like good. the and how they put the cheese on the fries. It was amazing. Yeah, they put cheese whiz in the fries. It was the best thing ever. Cheese whiz on the fries. Okay, so, but give me a little bit more than good. What what made their cheese steak delicious? Uh, yeah, it really looked well, good. Well, me Into the Nolan, mic, buddy. Me and Nolan got like uh Nolan is their stepbrother. I, I don't I don't remember what we got, actually. You guys got the cheese uh, whiz. Cheese yeah, whiz we sub. got the cheese whiz. And okay. Brady got a plan. Yeah, so. I just got a normal with normal cheese. And we we split no we split up. Me. Wait a second. Wait a second. You got a you got a bread and cheese I, set. I, I no, 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 no. With the steak. Obviously. <laughs> but you didn't put nothing you didn't put nothing else on it but but cheese, meat and bread. That's all no that's, one that's, wanted. That's all every that's all we got. No one else got we anything else. We weren't allowed on. to it get anything extra. Cheese. Well, look, I understand thing. your mom's got. I, I got to pay your mom child support, so that's probably like. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna take a quick call. I don't know if the boys. I don't think they can hear it, but we'll grab it real quick. What? Uh, I think I can. Hi, you're on another dumb show. Hi. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe I got through. I'm Hi. so excited. <laughs> Who's this? So, so this is Michelle. Hi, Michelle. And. I am the weirdo on Instagram that's obsessed with your kids. <laughs> I don't know if you. Here, here's a little more. I'm of them. always boom. I'm, I'm I, always um, sending you messages about how cute your boys are, and and then I call in or I flip on the show, and they're sitting there, and I'm just so thrilled. I actually, the you you I know exactly who this is because I you, you you're well. First off, you're pretty, so I'm just a guy, and I, I recognize pretty women. Oh, period. Thanks. But yeah. <laughs> but I also then secondly <laughs> recognize how often you say all these nice things about my boys. So and I, it is really nice. So I do. Well, your one your kind comments made me realize. You know, some people there are people who have immediately saw the kids and went, "This is dumb," and turned it off. But I know there are people who do like seeing the kids, and so I said, "You know what? F the people who don't like it. I'm going to let the people who do like the." boys see them so michelle thank you for helping inspire me to uh, in introduce my boys here on camera and on mic to everybody well let me just say after healing hearing keely how respectful she was the other day and then seeing the boys and how respectful they are you're just doing a great job and i um, super happy to be watching the show and congrats 
Well, Damn. thank you. I appreciate that. I just realized you are three and three with your kids, and I am zero and two out here. <laughs> what do you mean, as far as <laughs> my kids? Have, my my son watches. My daughter is just oblivious to the fact that I do anything. So You're, that's that teenage girl. Teenage <laughs> girls don't give a crap about she is what the ad- hell they're dead. She's an do, adult right? woman. That's what oh, I'm saying. Like she doesn't still, even really care anything. Well, mine's an adult woman. Like what? What is soldiers? Um, nineteen. I I oh, told no, her that's still a teenage girl. <laughs> it's yeah. not, when my daughter was nineteen, she did give not two craps about me. She's twenty one now, so it's that, those two years are a big difference. So you call your two it's sons come back around? Yeah, maybe. she'll swing back. Trust me, she you, will. You call oh, your two my. kids a nerd? Uh, your two sons a nerd? I told, I texted my daughter because I was excited. I solved the world today in in two tries, <laughs> and <laughs> she she just said, "Why would you have guessed that word?" And I was like, and I explained it to her, and like. Seven seven line text and she just texts back <laughs> nerd. Larry's still upset. Yeah, Larry's still obsessed with Wordle. Uh, I did get somebody. Uh, uh, my friend just texted me uh, the. There's a new one framed or something. It's like a screen grab from a movie. To yes, see that's the it. one. I love that yeah, one. That's that awesome one too. Out. So, well, Michelle, again, thank you very much for well, number one being uh, so kind, saying the nice things you said about my boys, and of course, number two for thanks. checking out another dumb show. Uh, and uh, thanks for all the likes on there. I really appreciate it. Yeah, congrats, guys. Good luck. Bye-bye. You too. See ya. I um, I think I pissed her off when I said she was pretty. I think she wanted me to only recognize the, her for liking my kids. But I mean, That's all she called in for. I am she a, knew you were going to say that. Well, I am a, cave, <laughs> I am a caveman at heart, guys. I'm never going to get over that. I am really am a cave. That's the boys. They can't. I'm, I'm like my dad. Like my dad when I was younger, he was like, he'd point out every, from as young as I can remember, every pretty girl on TV or in public or anything, he was mm-hmm. pointing them out. Oh, yeah. That makes I have like the same. I kind of hate. <laughs> Brady said that makes a lot of sense. Is that what you said? Yeah. Yeah, because I have the <laughs> same habit. I do the same thing with them. Like yeah. I kind of. I'm not quite locker roomy with them yet. Oh. But I am, I am very much like uh, the elbow. Like if uh, like if B one's not looking. Yeah, I'm to, I'm, to, I'm, to, I'm to that point with yeah. my son now too. But it yeah. took a while, like in mm-hmm. my life with my like my wife too, to be able to point it out to my wife too. Like yeah, little, well, I'll be walking around like, what the. Look at that. You know? Yeah. See, I love, women love when you do that. You see how hot she is? But I, anyway. Um, you two. Yes. Gentlemen. Yes. Uh, what are you going to do the rest of the night? You gonna go, we're going to head back out and play some games up front? Probably, yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. Shay. I'm not sure. I want to give you a little bit of props. Well, I'll give you both some props here. Oh, uh, real quick, what I do want to say, speaking of props, Michelle just said what a great job I'm doing with the boys. <laughs> Their mom does most of the work. They come see me every other weekend. We, while we do have a great relationship. I was wondering if you are going to catch I, that. Yeah, as much as I do the you know a lot of hard work uh, taking care of them, Andrea does most of the work. So uh, she's done a fantastic job, and her, their stepdad's actually great too. So uh, we're very lucky. We've all put together quite a co-parenting situation where we all get along very well it uh, takes a village well we got i mean it does honestly once <laughs> you know once i got grew up a little bit and stopped being such a baby about everything and realized you know she's there are well, i have a great ex-wife trust me there are guys out there whose lives are made miserable by their ex-wife and i do not have that problem i have a pretty good ex-wife she's busy making brady's life miserable miserable doing, <laughs> doing chores and stuff um, Lou, give me that time stamp it's, it's more, uh, i have a great ex-wife i just need that <laughs> what'd you say buddy what'd you say what what'd you say I, what you said something under there and then i think that mind. guy said it i didn't say anything oh, okay just, it I was get, a quip I he get, can't repeat oh I get a lot more chores than I feel like most everyone else does. <laughs> or I get the really well, Brady, big, like, hard Brady, chores. Brady, you say you want a big Shay, house. You, get, no. you say you want no. a big house, and okay. then you make problems okay. with the, choice, the chores <laughs> should that I make you a, should, have. Should I tell them they should stop no, talking? Or just okay. let them go, right? Okay. I didn't care. Uh, that, so welcome to my, a little bit of the inside of my world. I <laughs> usually let that go on for... Five minutes. About three minutes, usually three to five minutes before I uh, instruct them to stop it. Nobody wants to listen to you two bicker. There are other people in the house, so <laughs> shut up. Stop it. And they usually do. So, uh, gentlemen, it has been a pleasure oh, having you two here go. in the studio. You're kicking us out already? <laughs> yeah, you're little kids. Really, nobody gives a crap about it. Don't y'all got saying. games that you're yeah, playing? There's, that's what I'm saying. There's boy, there's video games up front, and there's leftover pizza. There's You guys can finish up that pizza, too, by the way. There's plenty of pizza left over, so you guys can eat that pizza. And, uh, gentlemen, it's uh, been good having you here. You want your exit music? You want to exit to that music? <laughs> no, 
Hey, shit. take those headphones off. Don't roll all the way back. No, 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 no. All right, you ready? You try. All right. No, I'm done. One more time for Brady and Shay. Here we go. They're out of here. Come on, come on, perp walk it out. Let's yeah, go. Seriously. Like, get it <laughs> Strut, boy. Strut. <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, that was fun. All right.